related articles snowflakes 4 in 10 young people anxious over Brexit and Trump health and safety snowflakes wreck traditional pancake day event Among this generation there is an underlying sense of entitlement Gresham's head Douglas Robb Douglas Robb's comments triggered howls of protest from former pupils at Chum School in Norfolk, which counts composer Benjamin Britten and actress Olivia Colman among its alumni. In a blog carried on the school's website, Mr. Robb, who has been Chum's head since 2014, said he was concerned that some youngsters had unrealistic expectations when it came to work and lacked grit. He said, among this generation there is an underlying sense of entitlement. I don't blame them. They have been advertised to since birth, they have had credit and loans on a plate, they have been overly molly coddled and they have been overwhelmed by a strange combination of fictional sitcom characters, reality TV and social media stars, who paint a picture of perfection to be achieved. They have even been encouraged by governments to believe that they deserve more than their parents and grandparents had. Bemoaning the fact that something has been lost, Mr. Rob said. There used to be a real sense of pride associated with doing an honest day's work, whatever the role might have been. There was also a real sense of achievement among individuals who, having started on the bottom rung of a company's ladder and having been recognized for sheer effort levels, or standout skill, were fortunate enough to work their way up the ladder maybe from tea lady to typist, or from floor sweeper to factory foreman. Former students took to the internet to voice their unhappiness at his comments, with Rebecca Lawrence, 23, who attended gyms between 2007 and 2011, saying, These assertions left me feeling uncomfortable. Negative stereotypes of millennials are to a penny and you don't have to look far to find the source. I feel like he's in a Gresham's bubble, maybe children at his school are privileged and so are more entitled but he shouldn't generalize our generation from a few. Speaking later, Mr. Rob added, we try as a school not to mollycoddle our students to develop the ability to have their opinions challenged through debating societies and other forums. Giving students opportunities to experience the sorts of tests of spirit and resilience is what we mean when we say that emphasis should be placed on encouraging grit. Located in the town of Holt, Jims has about 800 pupils aged between 3 and 18. Related articles Brexit caused snowflakes to seek relationship and sex life counseling LBC host berates Fleet Street lawyer over anti-Trump snowflakes fury as Manchester Art Gallery removes sexist nymph painting.